Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Ascended on the Aberration Ascended map. We're back and we finished our base. Let's show it off real quick. So we made our little balcony area like I showed. We made the roof. Um, I have some scrap forges over here for um, Gunner's Mod, the bed, the campfire, you know. Just the basics, Gunner's Workbench, Gunner's Smithy Mortar Combo. Um, what is that even called? Spoiler, so I can make plenty of biofuel. We put these little chandeliers up so we have a little bit more light. Preserving bins and a couple storage boxes. That's pretty much it. So, first things first. I was just talking with some of the fellow survivors about this. And let's make it. So this way, we have a little bit of extra light. Oh, the backpack's not appearing. That's weird. Megan said something was up with it. Well, the light works. So, also, we have our new sign. We made this for Aberration, and the gunner already added it. And then also Megan's sign as well. She made that one. It looks awesome. So yeah, all in all, the Fallen Nexus is pretty much ours. <laughs> um, I can't really get a good view, so let's just and jump. Okay, there we go. So I just want to show off how I did the roof and everything like that real quick. So let's go to K mode and let's run. All right, so have these little things that I designed. We go all the way up here, and then if we go down here, and that's pretty much it. So, just gave it a few different shapes here and there. Wanted to switch it up a little bit, as usual. I actually feel this one's more similar to my um, Island Ascended build. Um, also, if occasionally I get a supply drop right around here. One of those, like, triangle ones. forgot what they're called cave ones or something like that I don't remember so what do we have in store ouch for today how much fall damage did i actually take eh, a little bit i'll be all right what do we have in store for today well first things first one of those drops we got this so we do have some jerky we'll keep that on us found some arrows though so We've been just smashing up rocks, so we were able to get metal. I don't know if I can make armor. Um, black. I don't have any polymer. Yeah. Okay, what about regular flak? I think I can make the regular flak. I can't make others. Hide. Okay. There's your hide. Pull, craft that, pull, 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 and pull. Okay, perfect. Go. Wait, what? I just pulled for everything. Oh, yeah. Pull, pull, and one more. There we go. Okay. Now, let's look at the skins. Hmm. I don't see any skins. Okay. Interesting. Let's get our armor on. Let me just, maybe if I type it in here. Steampunk hat and goggles set. That's weird that they don't come up in the other thing. Ooh, boater hat. What's this? Ooh, I'm, I'm gonna make this one. Pull. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, it's a eh. You know what? That actually doesn't look terrible. I could work with that. Right, what else do we got real quick? Uh, engineer hat, engineer pants. 
Hembrin. Oh, that's. Oh, man, there was more. Cyclist hat. Oh, that would have been cool. What do we have here? Drifter boot. Oh, these are the. Uh... Oh, I can make those? Oh, I would have I would have made my regular sinister hat then if I knew that. Huh? All right. Um, let's do this. Pull. Craft that up. Engineer pants. Pull. Guess the engineer boots. Skin. Pull. And pull. Oh boy, it looks funny. Uh, definitely looks hilarious with the beret. All right, well, why does that thing have to be around my neck? Is that part of the beret? Skin? No, it's not. Okay, well, we'll keep it for now. We look ridiculous, but it's fine. All right, so um, I forget which one do I have some of my supplies in. All right, this is what I was looking for. Is there anything in here? Nope. All right. We did make a little bit of narcotic, I believe. Right? Yeah, forty. That's not much. Still a lot to go with that, but it's okay. We'll be making progress. So what, I, what I'm mostly worried about is dying and, and not being able to get back to my base or not getting my body back. Uh, we'll see. I wonder what happened with the backpack mod that it's all messed up. And I do not believe that it keeps away um, nameless. So, at least this would, I believe that's what Novi said. Nobody already has the, um, what the F is the name of that silly, um, rock drake chicken thing. The Yi Li, Yi something like that. He already has like 35 of them. <laughs> He's definitely getting his fill. Right. Oh, floating rocks again. Oh, cool. I haven't seen that since, uh, Island Ascended. Thought you guys fixed that. It's not. Let's just take a little look around. I know there's some creatures around here. I was thinking maybe I could tame up a good stego. That'd be convenient and have a beast for some nice berry gathering. Oh, a glow bug. Wait, a chart light bug? I thought it was called a glow bug. It was definitely called a glow bug. What level are you? Can I kill you? 140. No, I can't. Oh, I need Gunner's um, keratin tool. What the F is it called? Harvester? Oh, what's no uh G D oops sure D G G Hmm. Right. Well that's not all of them. Um No. I thought it was called a harvester. Oh boy, we got an earthquake. Or maybe I don't make it on my own? I don't really remember now. I always forget the name of it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see it. I mean, this isn't everything, so... We got wood, stones, green gems, pass. Need some more useful stuff, people. 
What do we got? I can get that all over the place. Okay. That's a dire bear. Parasaur. Uh oh. Is that a Gigantoraptor? Whatever you got, you're level 20. Check those stegos real quick. Either of you good levels? Level 10. Okay, and you? 140. Ooh, that would be good. Ovis? What is an Ovis doing here? Hey, babies. Oh, you're, you're with a 10 for sure. Yeah, back here, you. That mutton. Okay. And let's. For the mutton spoils. Well, it's gonna spoil a little bit at least, but. Just get it back to base. Oh, wait. I think it's called the carcass. Oh, oh, wait. Yep, carcass grinder. Oh, I need carrots. Where are you? Actually, need keratin. I can't do it with, with chitin. Dang. Oh, oops. Fix it that way. That's okay. A little um, chitin always goes a long way. We can make some more cemented piece with it. All right. I'm gonna craft up a couple of things and be foolish and attempt to tame that 140 stego. <laughs> But we'll see. All right, I'll bring you guys back in just a little bit. Alrighty then, everyone. We are back. We did a ton of grinding, gathering, and crafting, and gathering, and more grinding. So we built a potion table, and we made one famine potion. Famine injector. Um, I don't even remember when Gunner changed the recipe. But, um, also, we made, we made a long neck, and then I went to check through Gunner's stuff, and the 10x arrows are available. And again, he changed the recipe because previously you need a titanoboa venom, but now you just need his G-Cotic. So I made sure to have plenty of narcotic and then made G-Cotic and all that good cotic stuff. And yeah, so we actually have some decent drinks on us now. So we're going to try to get that uh, stego that I saw. A ton of berries. Oh, the gloves look cool. I definitely will be getting a spino since they're pretty much everywhere below us. But first things first. We need something that can get a crap ton of berries because I need masses of massive upon massive amounts of geotic. All right, we got. 29, 20, yeah, it should, it'll be fun. Alright, so, let's get this ready. Oh. Pretty sure once I shoot the 140, level 10 is going to come after me as well. Ideally, that would be a great spot to get to if I could get it to follow me. Because I can just use the, um, <clears throat> I can just use the grappling hook. And get my big butt up there. I just gotta find them. 
and I gotta be careful of the Gigantoraptor and the uh, Dire Bear as well. Ooh, I don't know what level that Dire Bear is, but I could probably tame it up with the money. I just make a run for it. I think that's the level 10. Ooh, that's the 140. Okay. So, let me see. And shoot. Run. It follows me. I know the one arrow did not drop it. She is angry. I can get right up there, actually. Where is it? Come on, big fella. Mistakes were made. Ah. There we go. Where are you running to? This way. Come on, come on. Keep coming. Got it. Earthquake's probably gonna knock me off. It's down. Perfect. Alright, famine potion. That, take those, take these, and take those. Definitely not the best items for taming, but what are you gonna do? Do what you can with what you got. Get some more edgeware. Nice and hungry. That's good at least. Come on, come on. Come on. Stupid thing. Ugh. Can't jump on some of these things. Come on. Trying to get us some more medjo. There we go. Yeah, for the medjo. Moving great. Okay. Here. Oh. I'm glad Gunner changed the. You know, Titanable with me. I mean, there are aberrant titanable with it, but still, just make my life easier. And I'm stuck again. I'll probably tame up before I can even get to it. I'm stuck on rocks. Right, finish up those major berries. Here we go. First tame. Beautiful. Alright. Come on, big fella. Are you coming? Okay. Right. 
stack of saddle is made in the smith. Saddle. Uh, oh no, it's not made in the smithy. I can make it here. I don't have my hide on me. Perfect. Okay. Come on. Come this way. Come on. Jeez. Yeah, how slow these things are. Alright, I'll bring you guys back in a few minutes. Alrighty then, we are back. And we're finally on our second. Beautiful hit. I missed him every single one. Okay. Why are we not gathering stuff? Yeah, this is the regular one I believe. Um, okay. Plate. Did I just have it in the wrong mode? I mean, it looks like it. Yeah, it was definitely the wrong mode. Take your big butt home. I believe you can fit through those doors. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, close the door behind us. Oh man, such a great thing to get good um, gatherer in the second episode. So, give me this and give me that. Don't think I have much more spoiled meat. I think I burned through most of it. Oh, there we go. Do that. Make it work. And spoil that. in here. Make me some more spark powder. Perfect. Oh. Okay, confused. So confused. Oh, I put the narco berries in here by mistake. That's very messed up. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna need to keep making G-Cotic. Oh, I have a ton of narcotic. Good. Right where I burned through so much of my stuff. Um, oh, big man. I need some tinto berries for me. Hmm, it's not as many as I was hoping for, but it's okay. Right, tinto berries, narco berries, and a little more cotic. There we go. No, it's a cold process, so 
All right, so one of these, cool. So I need to make trank arrows. So I need to use narcotic to make trank arrows. Then I need to make geocodic, which requires narcotic. And then I can finally make the 5x arrows. And I need more geocodic to make the 10x arrows. So yeah, it's a fun system, but I, I kind of like the way Gunner does it. So, all right, so I have more of that. Good. Give me this. I don't want it to go bad. I feel like those lights I picked up are not shining bright enough. So, just throw this in here. Uh, you, you, and this one too. Okay. So, that will make a ton of, um, what is it called? Uh, can't remember right now. Oh, the biofield. There we go. So, forges. Uh, they're pretty empty. I burned through a lot of my metal supply. 24 pieces in there. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I kept, I gotta keep the raw metal as well because that's needed for, um, well, almost everything with gunners. So, nice. That's his name, Glowing Spikes. Even though his tail doesn't glow, it's still. <laughs> it, it was, but, alrighty then, everyone. Well, I think we're going to call it an episode. Oh, it looks so weird. We got plenty of things done in this episode. We got a 140 Aberrant Stego, and it is awesome. So now we have a great gatherer to keep getting more and more stuff, which I'm very happy about. And... We're just going to keep on progressing and keep on developing. So, hope everybody did enjoy. Please do like, share, subscribe. Check out the Instagram page for you. Better look at the thumbnails that I provide for you fine people. Also, check out all the other content creators' pages, YouTube channels, and Twitch streams. Also, go check out Gunner Does Games. He deserves a lot of credit for everything. I feel like half these series weren't going to be anywhere near their potential if it wasn't for his mod. So, GDG Tools, download it, support Gunner. He's an awesome dude, but that is all. Oh, good job. Take a nice shite, why don't you? But that is all for now. Until next time, everyone. Take care.